running here in Idaho is a totally different experience than running in Las Vegas. My first day running here was yesterday, Monday, and I ran my, because at home in Vegas, I was up to seven and a half miles. So I run a mile yesterday. I can't breathe. My muscles hurt. I've got cramps going on in places that I didn't know existed. And it occurred to me, oh, the air's different here. It's a little more moist, and it's probably thinner, I guess, right? You tell me. I think so, right? And so, it was extremely difficult. So I ended up running two miles yesterday, and I was just in physical pain. <laughs> so today I just ran two miles, and it's going to take a few days, maybe all week, for, for my body to acclimate to the temperature here, or the, the uh, air here. We'll see. I'm not, I'm not discouraged by it. It's just interesting. And I think in the end I'll be a more... I guess, well-adjusted runner, <laughs> I guess. Um, you know, once I get used to this, my body's adapted. But until then, it feels like razor blades are in my skin. It's, it's kind of funny. Uh, also, have you guys looked at our views lately? I, Cassie and I have been talking about this a lot. Our views, and we don't, we don't focus on view counts or subscriber counts or things like that very often. Because if you do, then you lose sight of the goal. And the goal is, just have fun and make content and interact with you guys. But every now and then, maybe once every two or three months, we'll look at things and be like, wow, you know, this is cool. Well, well we, look, we looked at it all yesterday, and we're all, we're, we're all, Cassie and I are just shocked and amazed with you guys, uh, and I just wanted to pass that on to you. Uh, our, our views are looking up. Our subscriber count is up on our little planet. We've just passed 7,000 subscribers, and that's mind-blowing to both Cassie and I. And... The interaction that we have with you guys it has increased and improved. You know, our likes are looking good and our comments and stuff are, are looking beautiful. And again, we don't focus on these things too much, but when you make two videos a day, seven days a week, there's a few payoffs, right? Uh, one payoff is getting to meet you guys. Another payoff is, yeah, I guess getting to meet you guys out in public or, or at VidCon or whatever. Another payoff would be, I guess, seeing views and seeing interaction. So the interaction category would be views, thumbs ups, comments, and stuff like that. And we <laughs> we eat it up I and mean, we love it. And it's just kind of a payoff for us, I guess. I hope that makes sense. So just thank you for watching us, I guess. And you're like, of course, duh. Uh, but yeah, if you watch us, you know, every day or once a week or once or twice a month, then just thank you. It's so, so cool. And we're, we're thoroughly impressed with you guys. Yesterday I had the first day of my new job here and it went really well. I love the people I work with and, and we'll see how it goes. You know, there's no promises, no guarantees, but worst case scenario, if it all doesn't work out, then it was just a rad job to have for three months while I was here and I got to enjoy the weather and become a runner in Idaho and my body's acclimated to it and it was just a great fun summer and whatnot but you know it could turn into something a little more permanent a little more stable we'll see I'm not too focused on that right now I'm just trying to enjoy myself and work hard anyways just wanted to share that info with you share that insight with you and wanted to say thank you for just interacting with us uh, but it's so cool so much fun so appreciate your views appreciate your kindness and everything and the story begins the story continues. Our story in Idaho begins, and our story in life continues. So thanks for the love, thanks for the support. Running halfway break. Oh, I'm exhausted. The air here, it's like I run half a mile and I can hardly get oxygen to my muscles. They all start cramping up, so I'm taking a halfway walking break. And as you can see, I'm wearing this delicious headband. My mother's it keeps your ears warm. So I'm expecting cars to pass and say, Mojo, what's going on? And I'll say, wrong, wrong lady, taller. Although I do have an inexplicable need to help people and to switch from milk to dark chocolate. I love running here though. I have to, it reminds me of when I lived here, which I do now. <laughs> but it feels crisp and fresh. 
I almost said crash, which is the hybrid of crisp and fresh. It's like, it's incredible. It's cloudy and it just rained. I can't even explain to you how exciting it is for me to be here because I never thought I'd live here again. So even though it's for three months, it's awesome. And it's like, you know how different smells bring up memories and things like that? It's just like the, the smell of the summer morning just gets me pumped. I feel like I can run or like fight zombies or, or hug babies, which I have one that I hug all the time now. Before, no hugs. Now it's just like, can't hug them enough. All these cars passing me, look at me like, what's this girl talking to herself about? Does she have anything important to say? The answer is no, but I say it anyways. <laughs>